Welcome everybody, uh, host with not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, today we're on Goldcrest Valley 19, we're on Farm Sim 19. And speaking of Farm Sim, uh, Sim Farmer 19, I believe. Putting the card in right now, make sure I'm right. Probably wrong, but here's the card. Go check him out and stuff. Uh, he had, as you can see there, he had that question about the uh, how this right here works. Well, this right here is a tether arm, and it's supposed to Ted, but on this here, it's unrealistic. It's uh, uh, not a tether. It's just a like a wind roll. It's like a rake. Uh, this is a, a realistic one here. We got. I have seen these out and about but I haven't seen this one. now this one's on the front of the baler now this would look really really good let me uh yeah fly mode here and we'll go and get the mower going first and I want to show you this thing here we'll get it started the Chrome Big M 500XXL. Folks, check this thing out when it unfolds. Unrealistic, yes. Is it good? <laughs> yeah, I like it. Alright, it, it don't look very big now, does it? Lower it down and wham! Get those extra wings. But what I got going on here, if you've been watching my series on Go Grass Valley, um, well, I'm not going to get into everything, but I got this grass field here that I was planning on mowing, but things went south fast. But we're going to make sure our work mode's on, drive the course that I already got, and he should start. There he goes. All right, we'll do, we'll do, uh, uh, We'll let him do his job. As you can see, he's going to go around the whole field once and come back and go up and down. I'm just going to watch him when he gets to that brown spot there because of this. That's an actual hill there. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, I didn't quite get right there, but it'd be all right. And the state of the grass. As you can see here, it is extremely ready to harvest. So yeah, we're going we're going to get to it. Uh, let's go to this one first. This is the one he was asking about. Fire this bad boy up. We're going to unfold it, and I want to take another look at it real quick. You see, it, it's trying. It's got a PPL that comes out goes across to all these now it would look realistic but these are tether fingers on here and I'll, I'll show you what I'm talking about um, these what it should be like um, yep, I'm on the front let's go ahead and unfold the baler while we're waiting lower that down and as you can see right here the way this is angled it will rotate really fast and pull the stuff to the middle um, just like a regular wind roller now this one looks I have seen this in uh, not in real life but I've seen it on YouTube I, I know y'all gonna say, well, YouTube, you know, a lot of stuff on YouTube's fake. Well, folks, it could be. All right, when you hit unfold, it unfolds everything, and this one extends out. I'm gonna go ahead and let that down. And also, let's pick up area here, go down with this. Now, this one here, yeah, the same way. But I've never seen it on a baler before. I, I haven't. That looks like a pretty good, pretty good outcome here. You know, both sides the same. And uh, 
don't know if I can get down there. I even got the telephone number there. I wonder if that's a realistic number. Anyway. But yeah, this, whoa. this is what it should be like right here. Uh, it's more like a, a rake type. And I'll show you. Uh, let's go over here. Or taters. And I can't zoom in on it. but You can see how the arms are made the same as that one. And they just flop the grass around so it dry out faster. And this is a windrow here. You got several different kinds. And yeah. That's a merger. It's kind of like a windroller in a way. Alright. Uh, let's go make a bell too in this one. Look like the big M over there. It's doing pretty good. We'll just go ahead and start here. We'll let it down. And show you how it collects. Let's see. I think I got GPS set. I don't know. Um, yep. Uh, do that. I'll drive forward a little bit. Alright. I'm just going to lock that on. I'm not even worried about that really. I just want to be able to get it where you can kind of see it. Not too bad. As you can see how they're just rotating. I don't, know if I can, don't do this at home, kids. But see, they just spin. And what they really do in real life is throw the grass out backwards and it just pitches it everywhere so it'll dry out faster. That's what this one does. Ooh, there's a lot of, lot of bales making it. I think I got the bales set to lower thing on this one. Um, yeah, I'll see it's 1500. Let's change that. Alt and J, if you got the mod in, we can change it to 20,000 liter bales if we wanted to. And yeah. <clears throat> I'm just going to make this one line here. And you see the difference in it now. Big time. Alright, we're just going to pull this guy over to the side. Uh, shut it all. Put the bale out. Fold it up so you don't see that again. Alright, let's go to the next one. And here we have to turn the frown and turn the baler on. And let it down. I want to do the same thing. Try to make a. Oh, you, you see the mower back there? I don't know if y'all saw that or not. Might want to back up a little bit and watch that. He went over that mountain, that hill. Baylor set to 4,000, so that should be about right. And you can see right here how it rotates. Can't really tell it's going the right direction or not, but it just rotates all that hay right down to the middle there. That puts it in line for the baler. Go ahead and go down to the end. Now we're worried about him. We got enough here to demonstrate trying to make this uh, kind of short video. I just want to give a shout out to what I say it was Sam Farmer 19 I think. Please forgive me if I'm butchering that for some reason. If it ain't wrote down I can't remember it. But yeah one thing about this though this thing is heavy on the front end. Very that. Turn that off. We want to poop them out. <laughs> Fold it up. I can't show y'all here.
So you kind of, well, you won't be cutting that sharp really in real life, but uh, you can tell there's some weight there. Now, right, go to the next one. Oh, you can see the mower in the back. Alright, this one's set to 4,000 also, so. And here, folks, all we gotta do is just turn it on. You unload it and turn it on. Woohoo! I think this one would be a, a better choice in a way because it stands out longer. So I'll skip that. But it's all based on you know what you can afford. If you're buying for realistic. If, you, if you're like me, you got all that money up there. <laughs> you're not worried about none. Go in cab here. You can see how this brings it all to the middle. And Baylor eats it. But anyway, I, uh, Sam Farmer 19, I hope this uh, answers your question and, and whatnot. And I'm sorry it took so long to get it out. But, uh, yeah, it's just one of those things. I'm a... Uh, volunteer firefighter for two different cities. They're both small, Luxor and Berlin. Uh, plus I got two kids that's teenagers. Uh, so that, between the fire life and family life and, and YouTube life, yeah, it gets kind of hectic sometimes. But anyway, this is the setup for those. That would almost make a good thumbnail let's see right about there i might need to take that just to make sure but anyway folks i want to get off here uh, go down below i have his link in the description i might add it to the new ones i don't know it all depends uh if i got room or not this guy's done he's done he, he's done he thinks he's done anyway <laughs> but yeah, uh, this is the big M mower. Whoa. Let me move this out of the way. Uh, probably be going to see this on future episodes. Uh, I don't know if it'll be on Medicine Creek or not, but yeah. But anyway, folks, I gotta get off here and do some video editing. And like I said, uh, E L E, folks. I'm, I'm stealing that from DJ Gohan. <laughs> Everybody love everybody. And I hope you uh, enjoyed this Sim Farmer 19. Uh, folks, y'all don't forget to go down below, check out the description, and don't hit forget, <clears throat> yeah, tongue tied. Don't forget to hit the like button. Share if you uh, want to. You don't have to. You don't have to do nothing if you don't want to, but I appreciate it if you do hit the like button, red button, and share me and all that good stuff. And donation link down below too if you're generous. Uh, but anyway, I gotta get off here. So y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I'll see y'all later.